Whether you are Tony Soprano or Mother Teresa, you really should watch this video in its entirety to find out how to minimize the risk of getting audited by the tax authorities. If you gain any value from this video, please hit the like and subscribe button below. Okay, let's get into it. The Internal Revenue Service, IRS, employs various methods and criteria to select businesses for audits. So the first question, what is an IRS audit? An IRS audit is a review or examination of an individual's or business's financial information and accounts to ensure compliance with tax laws and regulations. The primary goal of an audit is to verify that the reported income, deductions and credits on a tax return are accurate and in accordance with the tax laws. The selection process. While the specific details of the selection process are not publicly disclosed to prevent manipulation or evasion, there are several factors and risk indicators that may increase the likelihood of a business being chosen for an audit. As we come into the tax season, we have the Ned Flanders of the world paying their taxes way before the tax deadline date. Oh, January 1st. Better get going on those taxes, Nettie. And then we have a large percentage of the population leaving it to the very last minute of the deadline date. When everyone eventually files their tax returns and the deadline day eventually passes, how do the IRS select businesses or individuals to audit? Here are some common factors. Comparative data analysis. Comparative data analysis is one of the methods the IRS uses to select individuals or businesses for tax audits. This approach involves comparing the financial information reported on a tax return with statistical or industry specific data to identify discrepancies. The IRS maintains databases of industry specific financial norms and standards. These norms are based on aggregated data from tax returns within specific industries. By comparing your financial data to these industry benchmarks, the IRS can identify variations that may warrant further scrutiny. The IRS looks for significant deviations from the averages or norms within a given industry. For example, if your business reports much lower expenses relative to income compared to similar businesses in the same industry, it might trigger a closer look. Comparative data analysis helps the IRS identify individuals or businesses whose reported income significantly differs from what is typical for their industry. If your reported income is unusually low or high compared to others in your profession or sector, it may raise concerns. Analyzing expense patterns is also crucial. Unusually high or low deductions in specific expense categories, especially when compared to industry averages, may attract attention. The size of your business can also be a factor. If your business is significantly larger or smaller than others in your industry, the IRS might pay closer attention to ensure that your reported financials align with the scale of your operations. High risk industries. The IRS may consider certain industries as higher risk for tax non-compliance due to various factors such as cash transactions, complexity in financial reporting, or historical non-compliance patterns. While being in a high risk industry doesn't guarantee an audit, individuals and businesses in these sectors may receive closer scrutiny. Here are some industries that are often considered high risk by the IRS. Cash intensive businesses. Industries that primarily deal in cash transactions are often considered high risk. This includes businesses like restaurants, bars, retail stores and salons where a significant portion of transactions may be conducted in cash. Construction and contracting. Construction and contracting businesses are susceptible to cash transactions, subcontractor payments and complex project accounting. The IRS may pay closer attention to ensure that proper reporting of income, expenses and subcontractor payments. Real estate. Real estate transactions involve significant financial transactions and potential for complex structures. Real estate professionals, including developers, agents and investors, may be subject to additional scrutiny. Medical practices. Healthcare providers and medical practices deal with complex billing and coding systems. The IRS may focus on income reporting, deductions and potential abuse of tax credits in this industry. Legal services. 
Law firms often deal with trust accounts, complex financial transactions and various types of income. The IRS may scrutinise law practices to ensure accurate reporting of income and adherence to tax laws. Retail Retail businesses, especially those with inventory, may be subject to closer examination due to the potential errors in inventory accounting, sales tax reporting and other financial complexities. Inconsistencies or discrepancies Inconsistencies or discrepancies in your tax return can raise red flags and may lead to the IRS selecting you for an audit. Here are some common types of inconsistencies or discrepancies that could attract IRS scrutiny. Mismatched income reporting. A scenario of this would be from discrepancies between the income reported on your tax return and the information the IRS receives from third party sources such as employers, banks or investment firms. The reason for scrutiny would be if your reported income significantly differs from what's reported by third parties, it can trigger an audit. The IRS cross-references this information to ensure that all income is accurately reported. Excessive or unsubstantiated deductions. A scenario of this would be claiming deductions that are unusually high for your income level or industry or deductions that lack proper documentation. The reason for scrutiny here would be that the IRS may question the legitimacy of deductions that seem disproportionate. Providing proper documentation for deductions is essential during an audit to substantiate their validity. Cryptocurrency transactions. A scenario of this would be failure to report income from cryptocurrency transactions or discrepancies in reporting gains and losses. Cryptocurrency transactions are increasingly under IRS scrutiny. Inconsistencies in reporting income from digital assets may attract attention and lead to an audit. Random selection. Random selection is one of the methods that the IRS uses to choose individuals or businesses for tax audits. While many audits are triggered by specific risk factors in tax returns, a certain percentage of audits are selected entirely at random. The IRS uses random selection to ensure fairness and impartiality in the audit process. The method is designed to prevent any bias or targeting of specific individuals or businesses. The IRS employs sophisticated computer algorithms and statistical models to randomly select tax returns for audit. These algorithms consider a range of factors, including taxpayer demographics, income levels, and other relevant data. Filing late or not filing. Filing late or not filing a tax return can increase the likelihood of being selected for an audit by the IRS. Timely and accurate filing is a fundamental requirement of the US tax system and failure to meet these obligations can trigger attention from the tax authorities. Will you look at those morons? I paid my taxes over a year ago. Dad, that was last year's taxes. You have to pay again this year. No, because you see, I went ahead and year wise, I was counting forward from the last previous. Go! Oh! Here are some aspects related to filing late or not filing that may lead to an audit. Failing to file your tax return by the deadline can result in late filing penalties. The IRS imposes penalties for each month or part of month that a return is late up to a certain maximum. Accumulating these penalties can draw attention to your case. Late or non-filers may be subject to increased scrutiny by the IRS. The failure to file on time may be seen as an indicator of potential non-compliance promoting the IRS to investigate further. In addition to late filing penalties, individuals who owe taxes and fail to pay on time may face failure to pay penalties and interest on the outstanding balance. This can lead to a compounding of penalties and further scrutiny. Failing to file a tax return may raise questions about unreported income. The IRS may be concerned that you are not reporting all sources of income, leading to potential audits to verify financial transactions. The IRS conducts non-filing investigations to identify individuals or businesses that have not filed required tax returns. If you come to the attention of the IRS through these investigations, you may be selected for an audit. Late or non-filing with state tax authorities can also lead to audits by state tax agencies. State tax agencies may share information with the IRS, triggering federal audits.
failure to respond to IRS notices. If the IRS sends you notices or requests for information related to your tax return, failure to respond or address these issues may increase the likelihood of an audit. Ignoring IRS communications can escalate the situation. It's important to understand that filing late or not filing at all can have serious consequences beyond the potential for an audit, including financial penalties and legal repercussions. To minimize the risk of an audit and ensure compliance with tax laws, file your tax return on time even if you are unable to pay the full amount owed. If you cannot meet the filing deadline, consider filing for an extension to avoid late filing penalties. If you are unable to pay your taxes in full, explore options such as setting up a payment plan with the IRS. Addressing any filing or payment issues promptly can help prevent further complications and reduce the risk of an audit. It's important to note that the IRS aims to conduct audits impartially, focusing on potential non-compliance rather than targeting specific individuals or businesses. However, the factors mentioned in this video can increase the likelihood of being selected for an audit. To reduce the risk of an audit and ensure compliance, businesses should maintain accurate and thorough financial records, file returns on time, and seek professional advice when needed. Click here to subscribe and click here to watch the next recommended video. Thanks for watching.